In the case of 11-month-old Lila, Drew, you are not... Oh, Guys, it's your boy Blast Miss HD. Today we are here to watch some baby mama drama. Not from people that look like me, from Caucasian folk. I love how they have the you are not the father to white people version. <laughs> Cause we're usually the ones on that, man. It's not that black dudes are just really, really at being dads. I think it's that we understand a lot faster that be lying. Just to give you guys a little taste, I've been accused of being a daddy like three times. At least before I was doing YouTube. I was just a dude that had his own place. So he's got his own car, I'm smashing seven dudes. Well, the guy that has it most together is immediately the father. I swear to God, that's a lot of females' perspective of it. If you've got the most going for yourself, if she's smashing three other dudes, you're immediately the father. She won't even get the DNA test. I caught her messing with the other dude. She still tried to tell her she was pregnant by me. I'm like, I just caught you with a different guy. Come on. That's gotta suck though, to be a female. Cause I understand that'd be my build too. Now, I know I'm out here getting back shots from 10 different dudes, but why would I tell the truth that I'm pregnant by the homeless guy? Like I need a place to be pregnant at. Also, so you guys know, I'm building a website and on there I got five different television shows that I am making all about me. When the website's done, don't come over there unless you are as sick and demented as I hope to be one day. I'm lying, I'm there. Now this video is by George Gutierrez. Link in the description down below to do this. It's nothing but a low down, dirty sperm stealer. That's right, a true semen demon. He called her a semen demon? That sounds like a compliment to tell you the truth. I need me some semen demons. I think I had like two semen demons is the most I've ever had. Technically three. <laughs> Just, I don't know why it says it with such anger, man. She ain't demoning on him no more. That's why he's mad. <laughs> she took advantage of me when I was asleep. I did not. She took advantage of him while he was asleep. That sounds like a good thing. Why is he mad? I'm trying to get woken up the right way. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Damn, girl, you you trying to be my girlfriend. <laughs> you ass. Sucking me out of my sleep? I repeat, did not willingly sleep with her. That's how I know I'm not the father. This chick keeps running around town stealing sperm so her and her lesbian girlfriend can have a baby. She is sick and twisted, and I'm talking. And she brought her one of her friends with her? See, you just ungrateful. Your homie's just ungrateful, bruh. That sounds like a great female. What is wrong with some of these dudes? I of being caught up in all of her games. Listen up, you sperm stealing scam artist. When the result- A sperm stealing scam artist. You could tell this guy graduated from high school. <laughs> oh boy. Prove I'm not the father, you can right up your and you better think twice about stealing another man's sperm. This guy had to be a paid actor. You better think twice about stealing another man's sperm. Is it just me or does it sound like perverted McGruff the crime dog? <laughs> Only you can prevent the he. <laughs> yep. Sperm stealer. I don't know how you steal someone's sperm when he's denying the baby. So he basic, I, he basically I, said you're them. If I stole your sperm, why why are you denying the baby? Right. Like that doesn't make any sense. Damn! That's why he's so mad. She's smarter than he is. <laughs> that makes sense. Yo, how you denying the baby? You just admitted you came in me. You just have terrible timing, is all that is. I is at all. Drew, come on out. They should have did a lie detector test on this one. We asked the lie detector test, did she steal your sperm? And the lie detector test determined that was a lie. <laughs> like, you die. You willing as f <laughs> You need to be a dad. You need to be a dad. She's not mine. You're telling me that I 
raped you, but if I raped you, then how'd you get I'm a guy. of 11-month-old Lila, Drew, you are not... Oh, oh, No! That's, that's not funny! <laughs> he must have the best job or nicest car. It's the reason why she tried to pin it on them. And I know a lot of you guys probably have to be like, but BHD, that's awful. I used to think the same as y'all, all right? I swear to God, I was the main one being like, hey, if she opened her legs and gave you some vagina panties, you shouldn't be so much of a douchebag as to deny the baby when it's yours. I used to believe women were sunshine and rainbows and all that. Now women to me, it's like a moderately okay sunset sometimes. Like it's, it's switched over the years. Yeah, I love women, but they lie just as much as we do. They just as ain't as we is. And I know we ain't So they're just equally as bad. It's equality, baby. That's all this is. <laughs> Equal rights, go out of your way to be like, hey, look, no, I know 1,000 million percent he's the daddy, Maury. It's certainty, complete certainty. Maury don't help either. He always accentuates on the are not the father. Yeah, you are, and then he pauses for a second. <laughs> don't jump all over her, okay? It's okay, Lila. <laughs> Nope. No. Don't feel bad for her. Nope. Maybe try taking one at a time. If I got like six girls pregnant at once, I'd probably be crying too now that I think about it. Never mind. I'd, <laughs> I'd be sad as too. Okay. Lila. You want, you want to tell him anything? Oh, nope. I'm sorry, uh, nope. Drew. What you got to say to him? Hey, yo, I, I'd have been like, hey, like, you could still demon my semen. Hey, no, look, hey, look, no, 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 it's cool that you're crying. That's lubrication, baby. Where are you going? Don't cry. No, don't get No. <laughs> it's always that pitch of voice when they're walking away crying. No, come on. <laughs> you know I love you. <laughs> I feel like such a big part about being a dude is learning to lie good. You gotta be able to tell that lie and have it believable. I just refrain from telling women I love them because I'm terrible at lying. Terrible at it. Oh. James and his look at him like, yeah, semen demon. <laughs> yeah. The estranged wife, Judy, got married only uh, two months after they first met. Yep, there it is. That, Soon after that, Judy got oh, pregnant boy. with their daughter, Miracle. Judy took off with baby Miracle. And today, Judy is now in love with Scarlett. Oh, <laughs> See, she found somebody with just as little neck as she has. And since they're compatible, they in love now. Not only do they have as little neck as each other, but also as small amount of titty. When it comes to females like that, I always tell them I'm waiting till marriage. <laughs> I was, nope. <laughs> Penis. <laughs> what are those? I don't have that. What is that stuff? <laughs> Ooh. You're emotional and you're angry. It just hurts. Why are you so angry? Hurt what? With her? Because. I was there with He's crying because he married her in the first place. That's what those tears are for. And now all of you guys know how low my standards are. Oh. <laughs> when she had the baby, when she had the C-section. And you named her. Day one, and I named her. That's messed up. That's cruel, yo. See, that's the thing I don't like about the whole situation. I can even understand a female wanting the best for her baby or whatever. But if that's the case, then be with the mother that got the stuff you want to have. Don't smash dudes that ain't got nothing. 
And then when you get pregnant, come back and be like, oh, it's your I f man. Okay, I got a date with Bob, who lives at the bus stop. And then later on that night, I got a date with the dude who has a job and his own car and house. That way, if I get pregnant by the homeless dude, the guy with the career and who's financially stable can take care of it. She, ha she has my last name. And then two months after she, she had her, she left with her. On herself and the baby. Ugh. Oh, baby, don't open your mouth. Close that. No. Oh. Yep, man, she's an angry little Oompa Loompa, isn't she? Oompa, Loompa, Loompa -dee -doo. I don't feel bad about talking about her necklaceness now. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> he really is crying too. <laughs> You're not father material. You not father material. Have you ever heard the term, don't throw bricks when you live in a glass house? You can't be talking about nobody's fathering ability. Ooh. Damn cry, baby. Ooh. Bring yep. them out here, all right? Dang. He's... Ow! Ow! Oh, God! Why it look like G only got one collective titty? What? <laughs> it's like her shoulder fat is seeping down into her and it's merged them all together into one <laughs> long teardrop. You want people to know that you was with this? Come on, son. That's my kid. No. No. No, man. Run away. James, you are not. <laughs> what are you going to do about finding the real father? Are I know you... who her real father is. Yes. Are you going to tell him? Yes, he knows. He knows. Yes, sir. Thank you. If it's that bad for you, bro, just stick to having sex by yourself, man. Come on, baby. Like, you old crying and <laughs> Like the earth shattering cry. Today, I'm here to prove that my ex boyfriend, Trevin, is the father of my seven week old oh, baby, Andrew. Spider Man? Trevin and his fiance are denying that my baby is his. But Ooh. today, they're gonna feel real stupid. He looks so unhappy. <laughs> Look how unhappy he looks. He's. <laughs> oh. But when that test proves that they are wrong, Trevin lied to me and my daughter. He got Michaela pregnant, and then he dumped her to go back to his trashy ex-girlfriend, Katana. I can't stand her! I call Katana Cabbage Patch, because she's short, fat, and ugly. She is so- Ain't that the pot calling the tea kettle black. Boy. She's terrified that Trevin's gonna leave her for me. Once he knows, my baby is his! You're furious at your ex-boyfriend. Yes, I am. Why? I am very furious at him because he keeps denying his son and saying that it ain't his when I know for a fact it is. Well, okay. Yeah. So when you found out you were pregnant, you told Trevin. What was his reaction? He was excited. He wanted to be the dad. He came to my house and told me to my face, well, I love your daughter, I want to be with your daughter, and I'm going to take care of Andrew whether well, he's mine well, or not. Wait a minute, wait a minute. When did all this break up? Because he's now uh, engaged to another woman. When she's four months pregnant, he kicks her out of his house. Oh. 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 to me, he kicks her out tonight. The ex-boyfriend, Trevin, and his fiance, Katana. <laughs> Why does that dude look like he makes so much more money than me? There they go, clucking. Here's the devil! Ah! <clears throat> Bro, when women get mad enough, they start sounding like incoherent thugs. Ah! 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 There is no question that kid is yours. There we go. She begged him to take off the condom. What are you talking about? You don't know the facts. Oh, whatever. That's she begged that man to take off the In the case of seven-week-old Andrew, Trevin, you are not. <laughs> the mother had to run. Yep, there you go. 
Well, ho, ho, ho. She's mad. Oh. Be yep, okay. yeah, you, yeah, you're probably not, but you know. Here, I want Trevin here. You want to say anything to him? No, ugh. <laughs> He's saying <laughs> Good riddance, bitch. <laughs> Good luck. We have to be sure, but now we know, okay? No, you see what they're doing? Now they're trying to be friends with him in hopes that he'll still pay something. No, don't fall for that. Nah, 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 nah. I have no grudges against y'all. I'm just glad we found I know, we'll be all right. When Aaron and I met, we were very passionate. Ooh. We made love non-stop like 40 times. Oh boy. One day I had to go to the hospital for dehydration. I found out that I was pregnant with our daughter Zeta. Aaron claims that we weren't together long enough for the baby to be his. But yes, we were. At first, Aaron didn't even want a DNA test. I demanded that he take one. Cause now he keeps on saying Zeta isn't his. Aaron believes that our baby is half black or half Hispanic. Zeta may have olive skin, but she's white, not mixed. I need these DNA results to my marriage is falling apart. You and Aaron were making love so much that you got dehydrated and had to go to the hospital. <laughs> Come on out. See, and they always boo us like we ain't sh That's that that is so messed up. Look at the hair. Look, look at this. Look at this hair. Look at this hair right here. What is this? What is this? Man, look at this. Chin strap. Bro. She was with another guy, right? Before you got together. Exactly. And guess what? He was Spanish. Spanish. His hair is not curly at all. No. Ooh. Yes, he's She's Spanish. Not Spanish. In the case of 17-month-old Zeta, Aaron, you are not. <laughs> Haley is a liar. I took Haley in when she had nowhere else to go. She used me and slept with every time they could Harry around. All I ever wanted was to be a father. If Haley takes that away from me, I will never forgive her. First, let's meet Matt. Matt, come on out. You a liar, bro. You a liar, bro. How come you hung out with her in the beginning? I was trying to help her out. She didn't have nobody. And then she used me, cheated on me. You and Chase know each other, right? Yeah. No. You're not friends? Not no more. Not no more. We used to go to school together. We used to be close. Here's Chase. Chase, come on out. She called me every no, right there. Lie. You know, this is day one, we bro. Told no, you I didn't. Yes, you did, bro. You was giving us rides to appointments. <laughs> Five months into the pregnancy, you already knew. You ain't begging me when I got out of the hospital. That okay, Haley, I got it, yeah, Haley. Yeah. Hold on. Case a five month old Jenna Lynn. Matt, you are not the father. <laughs> In the case of five-month-old Jenna Lynn Chase, you are not. Oh. Oh. I knew it. Stop. I knew it. You don't no, no, uh-uh, don't, no. Baby, wait, I don't know, it was a prank. I ought to pull some football playing jeans on my <laughs> Watch that little bitch. stiff arm. Stop! No! Get away from me! When I was 17 years old, I called my ex-girlfriend cheating on me. You know what she did? She put a brick in her bag and she hit me in the balls with it. I caught my girlfriend cheating on me. She put a brick in a bag and hit me in the dick with it. It's slipping. If you're if that's the world your reality is, then you are fing slipping as a man. My testicles split open and my right one fell onto the ground. I scooped it up and I walked a half a block to the hospital. My bowl was in my hand. Now there's so much blood that the nurse has passed out. Ah, yeah, again, my ball split open and one of my testicles falls out. You about to eat that hole. That's real. 
I'll still I'll, I'll suffer the blood loss to sit there and watch you eat every si shovel every single millisecond millimeter into your damn mouth. I hey look, that's real. You gonna they even take my balls from me? And the doctor said I could never have kids. But then my girlfriend Michelle had our son Casey. He's my miracle baby. But my stupid cousin Robbie and his girlfriend Emma, they don't think I'm the dad. It just makes me sick that they can't be happy for me. My right testicle may not work, but my left one made my son taste it. She literally took your penis from you. Why are you do, oh my God, that makes no I sense. I am the father. No. Let me get this straight about the story when you were 17, okay? Your ex cheated on you, right? And you broke yes. up? and she got mad and she put a brick in a purse. She swung that, Molly. Listen, I, I walked half a block, I picked that up off the floor and I put it right back there and I walked <laughs> a half a block, a half a block, Molly, to the hospital. I have it. That's my baby, 100%. Yep. In fact, by the way, you had been with an ex for a long time, right? Yes, I was, uh, I was married for four years and we were trying for almost a year to have a kid and we broke up, I don't know, about two months later, she got pregnant by another man. Uh, I got with Michelle, and nine months later, she's having a baby by right. me. Here they are, Robbie and Emma, come on out. That has to be the funniest exchange between two men I've ever seen in my life. The big dude's just looking at him like, you are an ant. What are you doing? And the little guy is like, please respect me at least a little. At least in front of the people, respect me. <laughs> Why are you so positive that he's not the father? There's been times where, my, uh, where Michelle has cheated on my cousin. No, no. Yeah. How come you don't believe us then? Because realistically, because, uh, realistically, do you, realistically okay, look at the nose. He the doesn't nose have no mine. features. Look Sandy, at it. Sandy, that Sandy looks Sandy like you is his eyes. No. No. Sandy is. Oh, no. If you look, if you look. Look, he don't have the look. same hairline. One set of eyes is darker and the noses are different. Because no. the nose is not eyes. Gary, first of all, let's take the temperature of your group. Well, Maury, uh, in the 20 plus years you've been on the air, we've seen it all. And today... Is that the dude from uh, Power? It's Tommy from Power. We're hoping to see a miracle. Right. <laughs> By this backstory. In the case of four-month-old Kason, Dustin, you are the father. <laughs> Hey, whoever wrote this ain't shit. You're nuts. They know he's missing a the ball. They ain't shit for that. That's fed up. I told you. I told you. It's a miracle. It's a miracle. You should be happy for him. Yeah. Let me go. Tell your family. Okay, good to see you. I told you. I told you. I told you. I, 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 I love how like only one third of the people are actually touching his hand. Like other people are like. <laughs> All right. Well, obviously, you scored the winning touchdown. Scored a winning touchdown. That was actually uh, a lot funnier than I thought it would be. It should not be so entertaining to see people get all their hopes and dreams crushed. <laughs> the women get so mad. Yeah. <laughs> Yo. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to comment, like, and no subscribe. It's your boy Blast from Sage D. Also, make sure to look out for the website. But I'll be keeping you guys updated. Twisms.